case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. A 2011 Florida District Court of Appeal case, Levin v. Levin, focused on the validity of a will executed under an insane delusion. The case involved a dispute over the will and trust of Shirley Levin, who passed away in 2008, leaving behind a fortune worth over $3 million. The will appointed Shirley's son, William Levin, as personal representative and trustee, with him receiving the majority of her assets. Her daughter, Gail, received $350,000 and contested the will, citing undue influence and insane delusion. The trial court found the will and trust to be valid, rejecting Gail's objections. Gail appealed, arguing that the trial court ignored important evidence, such as her medical records and an expert witness. The appeals court determined that the trial court had not made any errors in denying Gail's motion for continuance and expert testimony, except for failing to consider evidence of an insane delusion. As a result, the case was remanded for further proceedings on that issue. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.